Hey guys, what's going on? It's Weird News Wednesday, and of course, as always, we have some really strange, really funny, really crazy stories for you. And uh, you know what? Let's just get right into it. A recent record for the world's biggest hips has been set by a woman named Mikkel uh, somewhere in America. Uh, she's 420 pounds. Uh, but her waist is actually 40 inches compared to her 100 inch uh, hips, which, you know, that's very, not, <laughs> it's very small in proportion to the hips. And that's crazy. So, I mean, look at these, this picture. It's like, oh my goodness, girl got a big booty. I, my goodness. I mean, what's it like to sit down if you're her? I mean, does it feel different from sitting down if you're anyone else? Like, I, I, I've never experienced anything like that. I've never had that. I've never had that, like, big butt issue, I guess. Uh, but holy crap. I don't, I don't even know what to say. I, I really don't. And uh, her husband in the article made a comment like, I'm equipped to deal with heavy machinery or something crazy. I thought that was kind of cute and funny. Uh, but I'm really impressed. I, I'm really, really thoroughly impressed. I, even if it's not really something she can control, I'm still just mind boggled and impressed. And I'm sure you guys are too. And you're like, holy crap, what would that be like? In Kansas, a police uh, evidence facility, so like where they store all the evidence, they found a bunch of mice living in all, in I guess three pretty large containers, bags of marijuana, and the mice had chewed up a lot of it. So basically, these mice were getting high as shit. So high. <laughs> I don't know. I just like this story. I think it's funny, like that the mice are stoners. They they said the like the mice didn't really live anywhere else. They just nested in the marijuana, ate it occasionally, and you know just chilled. <laughs> Poor mice are kicked out now. They're gonna have horrible withdrawal problems. In Friendship, Maine, and let me tell you what a wonderful town for this story to take place in. Well, in Friendship, Maine, this woman. <laughs> She looks like a partier. I like her. She looks like she knows how to have some fun. She pulled a knife on her two friends who lived two trailers over after they would no longer have a threesome with her. So <laughs> be careful who you're going to have a threesome with. You know, this woman was obviously very frustrated, very pent up. And, uh, you know, as soon as that threesome wasn't going to happen, she's like, I would rather cut a bitch. Um, and that, you know what? The same day, the story also talks about how in the same day, a woman in Illinois who was doing an S&M photo shoot, which S&M is like sadomasochism. So pleasure from pain. That whole thing, like if you whipped someone and they liked it, that, that would work. Uh, during the photo shoot, the woman became angry and started beating another woman with a baseball bat. So, you know what? The moral of this story is, uh, bitches are crazy. I, you know, everyone knows it. It's really famous saying, but it's so true. So true. The Chicago public school system made a little mistake when after sending an email to parents, they realized they had made a typo in the link that the email was referring to. And the, e the email was talking about their uh, school website and they made a little typo and sent parents to a website, I guess, for, you know, 18 plus women invite only or something. So I, I don't know. It's... um. Probably like a dating website, but more adult, if you know what I mean. I think that's basically what it was. It didn't describe the website too much. It just kind of said 18 plus women. So not sure exactly, but the Chicago Sun Times, which is the newspaper in Chicago, they talked to the website owner of the pornography website or dating sex website, whatever it is. And she said, I actually got a lot of signups from it. So cool. <laughs> You know, there's there's probably all those mothers who are like really pent up single mothers. Maybe they're like, this is this is great. I like this school system. This is this is a good deal. 
they know how to party. (laughs) That's weird news for the week. If you want to check out last week's episode, you can go ahead and click the screen. Other than that, I hope you guys have a fantastic day.